For many people, the sound of sleep is anything but silent. And for some of these people, snoring could be a sign of sleep apnea. Sleep apnea means that the airway, the upper airway, cuts off at night. So the person, while he's breathing normally in the daytime, when he goes to sleep, the muscles get all relaxed and cut off. And this can happen over and over again, 60 to 100 times an hour. Dr. David Gross is a pulmonary specialist at the National Rehabilitation Hospital of Washington. Doctors say most of the people who snore do not have sleep apnea, but most of the people with sleep apnea snore. And increasingly, the condition is being recognized as a risk factor for stroke and heart attack. Dr. Michael Twerry at the U.S. National Institutes of Health explains why. Whenever we run out of enough air to breathe, and we, you know, it sends alerting signals to our minds, it raises the level of stress hormones, it tells our heart to work harder. So the heart is working harder than it should every night. And it's constantly it's exposing us night after night to periods of insufficient oxygen, where our, the level of oxygen in our blood will actually decrease to levels that would be considered even in a medical emergency. Dr. Twerry likens the effect of sleep apnea to that of racing a car engine for prolonged periods of time. It wears the engine out prematurely. Our heart becomes overworked and we become more vulnerable to heart attack and stroke. Dr. Twerry oversaw a study of about 9,000 people who had sleep apnea but did not have cardiovascular disease. The researchers followed them over a nine-year period of time. Then they analyzed the data. They found that uh, men can experience up to a three-fold increased risk of stroke and that that risk uh, seemed to be well correlated with the severity of their sleep apnea. The next step in the research is to find out if people who already have had a stroke or heart attack can lessen the risk of having another one by using a machine like this when they sleep. It has a mask that's hooked up to a motor that delivers constant air to the throat and lungs, making it impossible to experience sleep apnea. Carol Pearson, VOA News.